Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Uh, welcome to the second part, part of the lecture. System, system usability uh, scale. To get user reviews and user has transferred with strong agreements. This agreement is one, two, three, four, two, five. Three questions. We are ten questions. The odd questions are uh, positive and the even questions are negative. So for odd question, we have to subtract it from. Uh, 5 U user v2 minus 1 user v2 minus 1 for r questions and for even questions 5 minus user v2 so this was the formula for example in this question is the two total there is 5, so 5 minus 1 is 4. So this question is 4, so 4, 5 minus this 4 from the user is 1. This question, 5 minus uh, 2 minus 1 is the R questions. 2 minus this 2 minus 1 is equal to 1. For this question, 5 minus this 1, so 4. And in this method, each question, each R questions, just subtract 1 from R questions. And for even questions, just um, five minus one. Another thing, uh, so the total value is twenty-two. So to, uh, to, uh, then we multiply it by two point five to get like percentage. If you still are in doubt, you can say that the for eight questions, value this value means zero. This value means one. This value means two. This value means and this will means 4 and for hard questions you can see from here this will remain 0 this will remain 1 this will remain 2 this will be 3 and this will means 4 from here you can see that this will means 0 1 2 3 and 4 here 0 one, two, three, and four. This is how to calculate the score. So, user selection. For example, here user select one, but the calculator will use four. So, this is how uh, the sus is calculated. If you have still confusion, please watch the previous video. And uh, this lecture. Okay. Now we have to calculate from group data. Usually in scientific papers, we have uh, too many users, 10, 20, or 30, and we have to collect their data in one single table. So, how to do that if we have more than 10 users or more than 2 users? So how to calculate the sus for do we need to show uh, each individual users in one table and how to do it so for example this is data from three users so just write each questions and how many the student have checked strongly disagree right here is this is one this is two this is three and this is four and this is five so how many users have checked one strongly disagree so how or right here how many have two here are three users so and you can see all of them are have selected three five so how to calculate the video Three users and each user all user calculate two 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 so three uh, five sorry each user calculate five so four multiplied by three users so the value is twelve then divide by three so average is four Okay, 
Our question number two. Two users have value one. But it's even question. So five minus one value is four. And total user are two. So the value is eight. Five user two user have value two and one user is one. So five minus sorry one uh, one user is two. This is two value. Five minus two three. Three plus eight eleven. Total value is eleven. Eleven divided by two uh, three two to three point seven. Here this is again our question. So just subtract one. So three users and each five five five. The total is we will calculate four four four. Twelve uh, divided by three four. Again, two users uh, have two values, so two 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 is are four. Plus one user has four. Sorry, this is even question so far. Even we will subtract it from five. So five minus this two three. Now there are two users, so three plus three six, and five minus four one. And one user is here, so total is seven. Seven uh, divided by three, two point three. So this is the method. You can see in the next slide. Here, the three users. So, in response to statement number one, all three users rated five. Therefore, the average calculated is five minus one. 5 minus 1 multiplied by 3 and whole divided by 3. This is the total number, each this power average divided by 3. So it really is 4. Similarly, for statement number 2, 2 users voted 1. 2 users voted 1. So 1 means this is even question, so 5 minus 1, 4. This is for even question, 5 minus 1. For total users, who put it like this for 2 so 4 multiplied by 2 8 and one user put it 2 so two, 5 minus 2 is 3 so 8 plus 3 multiplied by 1 8 plus 3 11 11 divided by 3 3.6 or 3.7 the number 3 represent total number of users and is used for average calculations so the total average score was 32.33.2 multiplied by 2.5. So 83 is the SUS score. This is another example. You can say that part questions. Two users select five. So five means for art questions. Just subtract one from this video. So four or four eight. 2 user 8 plus 1 user select 4. 4 means 3. So plus 3. The value is 11. And total number of users are 3. So 11 divided by 3 is 3.6 or 3.7. Here you can see this is odd questions, even questions. So 2. Here 2 means 5 minus 2, 3. So 3 and 3, because there are two users, 3 and 3, plus 1 user select 1, so 4, 6 plus 4, 10, 10 divided by 3, 3.333, 3. so this was the, uh, another method, you can just, how many users select? user select uh, 5 so for each question you can see that the number of users should be the total 1 plus 2 3 here 3 user here 3 user here 3 is each and each to the total number of users so this uh, is the method of calculation for group data here you can see that question number 1 5 minus 1 because they select 5 
and how many user two users select five five minus one multiply plus four minus one how many user one user here and two here is so this is three point six again the second user one five minus one five was selected by one user plus two user select two sorry one this was one e is even plus is five minus one and this is five minus two because they selected two two users this so in this three point three and so on so forth so in this manner we calculated these values why we divide each question by three because the total number of users are three